I can't tell if that's footsteps I'm hearing or just a rickety old building. All right, we're going to go for it. Ah, uh, why is it dark? Okay. I don't like it. That door's open now. I don't think that one was open earlier. Oh, 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 is, the, is that is that the twin? Is that a twin? That is a twin. Crap. You don't see me. You don't see me. You seriously don't see me, bro. So it's the twins that are going to chase me. Fantastic. As if I wasn't afraid of those guys enough already. So I need to make my way to the third floor. Is this the way I came in by chance? I think it is. Ugh, the glitching camera. I don't suppose there's an inmate in here that can fix a glitchy camera, is there? Oh, look, it's one of the twins. Hi, buddy. You're not going to open that door on me, are you? Excuse me while I open this door and get TF away from you. Pardon me, I'm just going to shut this behind me. Yeah, see you guys later. You guys have fun with that. Those guys are called the twins. I've been looking up a little, like, trying to stay as spoiler-free as possible, but I've been trying to look up... Uh, I don't know if you call it lore, but what is with all the freaking doors opening and closing? Anyway, um, I don't know if you call it lore or whatnot, but I've been looking up some of the like facts and whatnot about this game. And um, so the big guy's name is Walker. The two guys that chase you around are referred to as the twins. Is this the kitchen again? Looks like the kitchen. Huh. This is where we came from earlier? No, I don't know. Maybe it's just another kitchen. Um, but anyway, so yeah, and the the big the thing we saw obviously earlier when I uh, in the episode entitled "God Help Me," I think I've seen the Wall Rider, was in fact the Wall Rider that we saw. Um, beyond that, I'm not sure if like some of these other people have names. Excuse me, sir. Pardon me. Can I ask you a few questions, sir? Do you have a few minutes for our Lord and Savior and uh, torturer and tormentor Wall Rider? Can you answer what exact? Do you have a few seconds to learn about the amazing story of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ? I'm kidding. Don't do that. Don't blast my comments with "Oh, Vlad's religion." Well, I'm not really religious. I'm not anti-religious. I just I, I believe in what I feel like believing in. Basically, we're gonna. I, I don't know if that's a smart move or not, but I'm gonna shut that behind me. Uh, I need to look around for some batteries. Freaking glitching camera is going to be a constant little eh. Alright, so is this one open? Yes. Hopefully Mr. Psycho over there doesn't. Oh, and the uh, the enemies that you encounter, the regular ones, like the one that several that have jump scared us so far, those guys are called the Variants. V-A-R-I-A-N-T-S. Variants. Well, this place is nice. I wonder if any of these guys know how to play pool. Hey, dude. What you watching? What you, is that a good show? Yeah, I love the Snow Channel, too. I love snow. We're going to read that docu or that note. Blah, 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 blah. Static prayer. The static again. A patient knelt in prayer. Maybe he bought Father Martin's line of bullshit. Maybe he hears what I hear, but more clearly. Maybe it's what, his way out of this place. The priest called it the Gospel of Sand. The Gospel of Sand? I really need to pay more attention to the audio. Like the actual people talking to me. Because I've n I, I'm pretty sure I haven't heard the phrase the Gospel of Sand yet. So, battery. I'll take that. It's a window, so that's outside, obviously. So this is just an off-to-the-side room that I'm kind of glad that I explored because I got a note and a battery. 
I'm guessing I have to fit my happy little butt through this crack, huh? Why do I not like the look of this? Excuse me, sir. Um, you mind saying a little prayer for me? I would appreciate it. I'll, I'll probably need it. Well, okay, so I need to go the other way. No, open the door. There we go. It's like amnesia all over again. Which, again, for the record, I actually have not played amnesia. No, nothing? Nothing? Good. Bathrooms, in my opinion, in my experience in this game, kind of mean batteries. And as we're all aware, batteries are more or less your lifeblood. You run out of batteries, it gets pretty difficult. Um, anyway, let's see. So, can I go through here? Nope, of course not. It's just a glass door. Can't just pick up something and throw something through it. No, that'd be too easy. I, uh... Yeah. Okay. Oh, Jesus. I'm freaking glitching. I was expecting that one. I'll be honest. I was expecting that one. So it didn't quite hit me as hard. All these people are praying, so I'm assuming... I am assuming that all this praying and stuff is pretty much Father Martin's, I guess, influence over everybody. Or Brother Martin. Is it Father Martin? Yeah, Father Martin's influence over these inmates. Jesus. Who knows? Maybe these guys aren't crazy at all. Can I go out here? Do I, do I want to go out here? I could only go around this way. I think I just came from that way. So I don't know if that'll be helpful or not. Yes, I am going to... Again, I am going to close my eyes every single time I walk through a door. Because I'm a little wimp. I, you've heard it here first, folks. Hey, fellas. You don't mind if I raid your room for batteries and such, do you? Yeah, I didn't think so. Excuse me. Looking for batteries. Don't mind me. Document. Excuse me, sir. I'm just going to read this, so give me a second here, okay? Okay. The Gospel of Judas. Now, that's interesting. I am an unworthy supplicant who can serve our Lord only by feeding our Lord. Please take me, wall rider. Let my shepherd's apostle see it and spread it with his lies for a greater truth. Your time upon this world has come. My flesh longs for your beautiful wraith. My blood is filled with you and waiting to be set free. This is my prayer. Write your gospel in my flesh. Interesting, to say the least. Documents are cool and everything. I do like myself. I do like getting myself a backstory. But I also really like getting some batteries, too, because it seems as though those are getting far, harder and harder to come by. This looks like a dead end if I've ever seen one. Alright, so I guess I'm going out the window. No battery. Yeah, I figured you'd be hiding a battery from me. Alright, guess we're going out the window. Don't know how long I've been going on for, by the way. Um, no idea. So I guess we're going out here. And we're going to go along this ledge here and hope and pray that nothing grabs us and throws us off. Boy, I wish I could see that the way it's supposed to be seen, but of course my camera's broken, so... Excuse me. Again, you don't mind that I... Whoa. God hates sickness. Does he now? Chapel. Uh, Jesus, what? Oh, that was freaking weird, but I can't go back through there, can I? Yeah, I didn't think so. How did I know? Anything? Alright, can I open this? No, I cannot. Again, it's glass, but we can't get through there. No siree. Can't get through there either. So, there's only one way to go, and that's this way. Going to the chapel. Excuse me. Pardon me. Could you point me towards confession? Oh, Jesus. It's the twins. Uh, hi... Uh, I'm going to grab that key. Where's Father Martin at, though? Is he here? My Job. Oh! You alone shall escape the Talva. Why are you crucified? The ultimate act of witness. The promise of the prophets was always freedom from death. 
And, and here it is. You will watch and record my death, my resurrection. And together we will be free. You are no longer in any danger. I fixed the elevator. It will take you to freedom. We will all of us be free. Will we now? Thou, my son. Yeah, I'd say so. I, I feel kind of bad for sitting here and constantly watching this, but at the same time, gave me a note too, so we'll have to read that in a second. I think Father Martin might be dead. I think Father Martin's got himself one hell of a headache. That's what I think. So, um, we're just gonna read this new note. The Passion of Father Martin. I can't believe Father Martin won up Jesus Christ himself in crappy ways to die. And I don't believe I'm gonna miss him. A way out. If he's telling the truth, now I've got a way out. And a story to tell. He wants me to spread his gospel. I'll tell the whole freaking world. Okay. Are the twins going to bother me now that their apostle is dead? Hey, fellas. John Cena, how do you feel about all this? Uh, what? What did that mean? What about you, John Cena's friend? Why are you guys... I mean, not that I'm complaining, obviously, knock on wood, but why aren't you guys trying to kill me now? That's like all you've wanted to do this entire episode... And now, all of a sudden, you don't want to kill me anymore. What gives? Anyway, moving on, moving forward, getting on with life. So I gotta make my way back to the elevator. Which, is this the best way to do that? I didn't even think about that. I could've just walked back the way I came. I'm obviously gonna have to jump down here. That means... Uh, no. I heard Walker. That's all I need. I don't even need to see him. I just need to hear him. Hello? Anyone here? Any batteries? Documents? Anything useful at all? Battery? Battery! Give me that. Uh, nothing in the fire escape. Or fire, <laughs> fire escape. Nothing in the chimney. I assume. Um, okay. So that room's a bust. Oh no! That's not good. I don't like it when Walker starts to chase me. Oh, he's coming through that door. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Okay, so there, I'm gonna follow his footprints. I don't know if that's what I should be doing or not. Run this way. Or should I have gone back that way, because that was the cage where the elevator is. Blind as a bat here, guys. And he's still chasing me like there is absolutely no tomorrow. I get the feeling he is probably going to catch me and kill me at least once. But then again, our buddy Miles Upshur apparently is a track star crap. Tra being a track star doesn't help if you're running into dead ends. I can't tell what's my breathing and what's his. I need to find the elevator. Crap. Alright, so this is the room I was in. Ow! That hurt. Okay, where is that one room that I saw? Was it? Yeah, it was right here. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be? Ow! Can't, okay, I'm dead. I'm dead. Excuse me, Walker. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to... Rude. Again, guys, chase scenes aren't that scary to me. Um, I don't know, it's just, it's not scary, it's just, ooh, it's a chase scene, I have to run from something. However, chase scenes may not be that scary, but, um, okay. Chase scenes aren't scary, 
So he can see me right now. Okay. Fantastic. Get, 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 get. It's right behind me. It's right behind me. Run. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Ow. We're going to run the way he came from. And hope and pray that it does something for us. Because, like, I don't have any place to hide now. I, I think I don't have any place to hide. Is this open? Of course it's not open. Why would it be? Excuse me, Walker. Sc excuse me. Excuse me. Hey, excuse me. Don't bother me. Where the heck am I going? Chase scenes aren't... Again, they're not... I'm probably about to die again. Chase scenes aren't really scary. Again, they're more... Like, here's an obligatory chase scene. Run for your life. Run into the dead-end room with this big guy chasing you while you try and find your way out. He's about to kill me. Yep. Alright, I might fast forward through some of this until I find which way to go. So stick around and I'll be right back. I think I might have figured it out, but I'm going to need a whole lot of luck to be able to pull it off. Just so you guys all... Oh, wait, never mind. I did figure it out, but this is totally not what I had in mind. Well, where'd he go? He was right... He was literally right... By... Okay, there he is. I was say, he was literally right behind me, and he just disappeared all of a sudden. Okay. Well, actually, again, that was not exactly my plan. I thought... That if I ducked into one of those rooms, those little hotel rooms or whatever they are, inmate rooms. Anyway, I figured if I ducked into one of those rooms, I figured that um, I could hide under one of the beds until he lost sight of me and then I'd be able to explore at my will. But unfortunately, that I saw the way out before that. So, where is he? I got here. Well, I feel the vibration from his steps, apparently. Has he lost me? I think he's lost me. Anyway, hope you guys are still enjoying this. I think we're going to get free of Walker. Find a place to cut this off. Oh, the elevator. Good. It's just like right now. <laughs> anyway, we'll go up the elevator, down the elevator, whatever. We'll figure out where we have to go. And, um... Alright, so that was third floor. That was second floor. That's the first floor. Hey, I need to get off here. Uh, excuse me. I need... No. Why am I going into the basement? I don't need to be going into the basement. I don't want to go into the basement. I, I really don't want to go into the basement. We're going below the basement here. Like, no basement is 60 feet down underground. Really? Why do I have to find another way out? Can't I just go back up and... Okay. Yeah, all right. We just got a saving, so we're going to cut the episode off there. Let me make sure I didn't get another note or anything. No new notes. No new documents. Okay, so we're going to cut it off right there. So I hope you guys are all enjoying the series so far. Uh, if you like the video, you like the series, do, do me a favor and tap the like button. It'll let me know that I'm doing a good job. 
However, if you did not like the video, feel free to dislike it on one condition. You have to tell me why in the comments. Um, and with that being said, I hope you guys all have a good morning, afternoon, evening, day, night, whatever, whenever, wherever you are. I hope you have a good one. And hopefully I will catch you in the next episode of either Outlast or whatever I decide to play next. So until then, take it easy and I'll catch you next time. See ya.